Hi everybody! I'm ready to go for Halloween. It's time to go to trick or treat. Well, alright, it's the first. I have to wait a little longer. But I'm ready! Want to see how I did it? Go that way. I'm going this way. Alrighty! Like I said, this one is going to be easy, quick, simple, something you can do to your kid. You know, you don't have to have all this. This is from another another video, different tutorial. So, anyway, if you've got critter ear headbands laying around from any other time of year, or if you go to your local dollar store and pick up a headband that's got, like, a ladybug or something like that on it, you can create a little mask, sort of, with some makeup to go with it. That means your little kid doesn't have to have their face covered with a mask mask. It means they'll be able to see better and they're still going to be cute. And you don't necessarily have to go out and buy a boatload of stuff. You just don't. I mean, all you really need for some of this is, you know, just your eye makeup pad. You could have, have just some pink to do a nose. Or black or brown to do a nose. You know, like if you're doing a puppy or a little deer or something. You know, a little brown nose leather. A little black nose leather. You want a bunny or a kitty, a little pink nose leather, you know. It's, it's, it's easy if you don't panic. Just don't panic. Panic is not good. Panic will not help you. Now. Depending on how old the kid is, or if you're doing this for yourself, you can glam up the eyes if you want. That's up to you. But think about this. I'm going to do a kitty. Even though I've got bunny ears on. Well, yeah, maybe I'll go with the bunny. It's still, you start the same place. You start with a little pink nose. Lip pencil. Yes, I tickled my nose. And now it itches. Tickle. Now, if you really want to go ape on this and want more definition, you can take an eyeliner or an eye pencil or anything like that and just go around the outside edge I never said I could draw a straight line and there's your little note
Now, if you're doing a critter that's got whiskers, you just put a couple little freckles beside the nose and on a few of them. You don't have to do all of them. You put a couple of whiskers. You don't, I'm not kidding, no, you don't have to do all of them. And they don't have to be perfect. You just want enough to give an impression all right that one's a little curly this one's a little strong but If you really want, you can put a lipstick on that goes with the nose instead of the eyes. Like I said, I just finished a different, a different toot with a diff whole different kind of look. If you want to know, you'll have to wait and go see. Since it's the 1st of October, we have to have at least one costume idea. We must. Because Halloween is coming. Yay. This one's simple. Some of the rest of them might get a little more complicated. But it's still going to be stuff that you've got in your makeup kit already unless you've only got one tray of neutrals then we might run into a few problems dollar store headband with some critter ears critter nose a couple of whiskers Go out and play for Halloween. I used to, when I was a kid, it drove me crazy. Going out for Halloween in one of those plastic masks with the rubber band. Because the rubber band always broke. But while the rubber band hadn't broke yet, your face is dripping from where you're breathing into that plastic mask and it's collecting around the nose and mouth. So it's yuck and you couldn't see anything. You had no peripheral vision. Much better. I wish my mama had thought of this. Get out your paints. Go play. Be good.